Hi, my name is Azar and in this video I'm going to share how you can get started with Automation Anywhere A360 Community Edition for free and also set up your device to create and run robots. So let's get started. To do this, you need to first register yourself on the website on your screen. I will put a link in the description, but this is a fairly simple form. First and last name, your email address, phone number, your company name, the number of employees, what level of job do you have in the organization, and what country you belong to. Once you fill the information, you click on this checkbox to accept the terms and conditions and click get free community edition so let me fill in this form all right the form is filled I check this box to accept the terms and condition and click get free community edition so typically it takes about 10 to 15 minutes but you should receive an email from automation anywhere stating welcome to automation anywhere community edition I have already received that email so let me switch to my email All right, here's the email that I received from Automation Anywhere. It has my control room URL, my username, a one-time password, some additional information for Automation Anywhere University and registering to the A People Forum. I will quickly click on the Community Edition control room URL. Now you'd notice my username and password is already filled. That's because I changed my password already before creating this video. But uh, you may log in with the one-time password and change your password for the control room login. Once I log in to the control room, I will... Once I log into the control room, this is the first screen that you'd see. You have access to pretty much all the products which is creating a bot, which is the main task bot window. You can also access your IQ bot. You can access bot insights, RE, and discovery bot as well. But first things first, you need to register your device to be able to create and run robots on this machine. So you need to do that. You need to click on this icon here, bot running device. If you have any devices, uh, if you have this device registered already, you see it here. But since this is the first time you're logging in and trying to register the device, this is blank. Uh, I'll click on connect local device and then connect to my computer. If you already have a bot agent installed, you would not see this window. But since I do not have a bot agent installed on the machine, you'd get a prompt to download and install a bot agent. So let me quickly open this and install on my computer. During this installation, you will see a prompt on your browser for enabling or uh, granting permissions to enable the Automation Anywhere A360 add-on. If you get that prompt, do select Enable. That helps the control room to connect to your local machine. All right. If you don't see the add-on prompt, you can select uh, Get Help, click on Get Automation Anywhere Extension, and then click on Add to Chrome, Add Extension, and you'd see automatically the control room is now talking to the local machine. Once you have everything set up, just click on Done, and you'd see your device is now configuring and your device should be connected in a few seconds let's close this and try to create a robot let's give this a name as demo 
let's click create and edit you can also choose the folder in which you want to create a robot but for now we'll just create a simple one with a message box on the left hand side you can see all the actions available for you to choose and uh, all you got to do is just drag them on the right hand side and uh, that's how you create a bot so uh, I just dragged the message box action let me put a message okay once you have the message in just click save and you can run the bot the first time you run the bot on the machine it can take a couple of minutes to download the necessary packages but it's usually faster the next time on all right so there's the message the bot was successful and that's how you can register and uh, register for the community edition and register your device on the control room thanks for watching and uh, catch you in the next one thank you